More fun awaits in the Philippines as we awaken the plantitos, plantitas, animal lovers, and farmers in you. Hello everyone, my name is Rami. Samahan nyo kami as we take you around Central Luzon over here at the Diaspora Farm and Resort. Grabe, almost a year and a half na ako na sa bahay. That's why sobrang excited ako pumunta sa farm na to. Just an hour and a half drive away from Metro Manila, Diaspora Farm Resort is situated in Bacolor, Pampanga. Kasi Diaspora means being scattered. Ganun din ang nangyari dito sa lugar namin. The people here were scattered because of the Mount Pinatubo eruption. Isa sa mga bayan na lubhang tinamaan ng 1991 Mount Pinatubo volcanic eruption. Guys, this is Lahar. Can you imagine this entire place was covered in this? For a while, no? Mga 15 years, parang di-share to itong lugar namin. Kaya hindi naging madali para sa pamilya niya na gawin ito sa kanilang farm. Pero they had to innovate, they had to work hard, they had to be patient para magawa nila ito. Ang volcanic soil daw, after much time, pagkatapos ng ilang mga tagal na panahon, very rich. Today, Diaspora benefited from all the early innovations and developments that were initially applied. Ngayon, oh, meron na silang mga fruit-bearing trees. Ang ginawa talaga namin dito is intervention sa soil. No? Kasi yung lahar, at that early stage, no, mataas ang sulfur content niya, kulang ang nutrients, di ba? So, pag nagtanim kami, aalisin namin yung soil, ladagdagan namin ng mga compost, yung mga nabubulok na ipa, animal manure, and it paid off naman, no? Ang idea kasi is, we need to take care of our soil, we need to improve our soil, pagandahin ang soil na, and then the soil will take care of our plants. For six months, tinuruan kami dito on how to produce our own fertilizer. Actually, ang concept ng vermiculture is mag-aalaga ka ng bulate. Alam mo, ang tawag dito is African night crawlers. Kaibigan nito ng magsasaka. Yung dumi nila, nagagamit mong fertilizer. Yung tinatawag na vermicast. Napaka-sustainable niya. Bakit? Kasi over the years, pa-improve ng pa-improve ang soil mo. Patamis ng patamis ang bunga ng mga ano, like yung nangyari sa aming dragon fruits. Mm. Bukod sa mga prutas, you can also enjoy farm-to-table dining with the freshest ingredients from the vegetable garden. Mapapansin din ang maraming kawayan at acacia trees na nakapaligid sa farm that actually have more than just aesthetic benefits. It serves as a windbreaker for the farm's buffer zone and it also protects the farm from wind drifts of non-organic sprays. When the pandemic struck, it was time to innovate and develop new concepts once more. Kailangan talaga maka-adapt ka. Hindi ka pwedeng magmukmuk na lang, di ba? To cope with the pandemic situation, marami rin naisip na i-develop si na Miss Annette. One of these innovations and new things to check out is putting up the cactus and succulent garden. The farm is also venturing into developing the farm's own food preservation and processing so they can offer byproducts like vinegar from fruits, pickled mango, and more. Wow! And if you're curious, gusto mo rin magpatayo ng farm? Punta lang kayo dito sa Diaspora Farm Resort and together with Miss Annette, she will definitely teach you everything you need to know. Naishishare ko rin yung mga best practices na yon, yung mga pinagdaanin namin yon, dun sa mga iba who would like to venture. Sa muling pagbubukas ng turismo sa bansa, you can look forward to checking out the entertainment facilities and amenities dito sa Diaspora Farm Resort. From Pampanga, we're moving next to a farm up north. Today, we are going to Isabela. <laughs> 